Well, hello there. Come on in. Welcome to my apartment. So, when you first walk in, we have this here on the wall. And I got this from World Market, and I love it because we can just put our purses, our leashes, all that stuff, and it's really nice and sturdy. So right now I have this really pretty wreath on it, and then this frame here, which is merry and bright. So little cute Christmas touches like that. And then if we turn around, to the left here we have our entryway table slash mirror area. And um, I love this little nook because it's so perfect for like a mirror like this, and I've always wanted a round mirror because it's nice when you're just like, you know, about to head out the door, just a quick glance, you can see your outfit. Well, for me, you can see like just below, but for a normal person, you can see like for a, For a normal person, <laughs> it's the whole thing. But um, I can see my hair and my makeup. And we have this little dish here where we just throw in keys and things like that as we're going in, just so that way it has one place for that stuff. <laughs> and yeah, moving on. To the hallway, I have this little gallery wall, also from Target. Right here, I have this amazing million subscriber plaque, and this is the first time it's ever been hung on a wall, which I'm really happy about. And then if you look over here, we have this really large art piece from Urban, and I just love the colors, and I love the beach, so I honestly ordered it not knowing how big it was i was like oh the biggest size whatever they have and then it came and i was like that's really big but it fits so perfectly right on this wall all right so moving on to the rest of the apartment so over here we have a guest room slash filming room and then a bathroom but i'll show you guys that towards the end when we go back this way we have this really big open space when i got this apartment an open floor plan was really important because i feel like it just the lighting's really good in open space and it just feels bigger. We have a hallway closet right here, which is where we put all our shoes and just jackets to throw on before we head out the door. Um, and then back there was our washer and dryer. If you come this way, this is the kitchen. And I love our fridge because I put a bunch of different pictures of my favorite memories with some of my favorite people. And I just like taped it onto the fridge and I'm gonna have to fix the corners, but I love this right here and then some different photo strips and polaroids and magnets from different places that i visited and then this is the kitchen stove area i have a little keurig in the corner right here i don't drink coffee this is a little thing for brendan but i like it because it's cute it matches my kitchen name <laughs> and then um, a little marble um, dry erase board which i put reminders to do's things like that which is really nice to have because we're always in this area so it's really hard to miss and then stove area and i love this kitchen aid it's so cute and then yeah cutting boards all that stuff leaned up against here i just love the look of the wood and the muted colors and the pops of the pastel blue i think it's really really pretty and then if you look over here there's just a little kind of bar area, bar cart area. And so I have just different wines and alcohol in this little basket. And then some random pops of uh, green and yellow from flowers and plants. Yeah, and then we have our pantry over here. Um, and then if you look over here, we have our island, which I love how the sink is like in the island, so that way I'm like facing the living room. If I'm washing dishes, I can watch TV still, all that stuff. So, really love this island. And then, if you come over here, on the other side, we have bar stools. Um, you should have bar stools. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> from over here. No, like, come over here and like, oh, shoot oh, this oh, way. Okay. Oh, the bar stools. I, I thought you were talking about the chairs. I, I don't know, it's so early in the morning. So, um, we have these bar stools that we brought back from, well, all this furniture basically is from Seattle. We hauled all the way from Seattle, California. And we didn't know how things would fit. We kind of just hoped for the best. And we brought three of them and they fit like perfectly right here. So I love this because in the morning I can just sit here, work on the island, have my breakfast. And over here we have this cabinet 
which I put a bunch of Christmas decorations on because I felt like the white wood is just gorgeous with these colors. And then in here we just have like books. Well, it's really messy, but there is some organization to this chaos. Um, we have our books and art supplies and then he has the school stuff down here and I have candles in here and I just keep all kind of like my stationary stuff, I guess. So I used to not really have a designated place for that stuff, so now I do, and I love this cabinet. It's from Z Gallery. I get a lot of questions about it. Um, and then we have our neon sign, and it says Memento Vivere, which means live in the moment in Latin, which I love. Oh yeah, that's from Neon Manufacturing. I got it custom made, which is pretty dope. If you turn around, this is our dining table, which I was so happy to fit in this place because this is a pretty large piece of furniture and there was no other place to put it if it didn't fit. So I love this dining table though. This is from Crate and Barrel and I just love the wood finish and how the side is like kind of that rusticness. And I feel like no matter what like decor theme I have, it'll work. For my Christmas decor, um, very Joetta Gaines inspired. This is literally all from her collection at Target. This is the living room. So right now I have the Christmas tree up and I love this Christmas tree so much. It's from King of Christmas on Instagram. I just love how just cute it is and it goes really well with everything else in my apartment. And then I have presents wrapped underneath there. And then this couch is actually the same couch that I had in my other house, but it was a sectional and we just split it up because there was no way for this tree to fit in here if we didn't do that. So we split the sectional in half. And so we have the bigger side right here and the smaller one here. And I kind of love it because you can just like sit here and like watch TV. Yeah, so the couch is from Crate and Barrel and it's gone through a lot. <laughs> but we've managed to keep it still. Um, I've had, had it cleaned so many times, but that's the thing with cloth couches. They look really cute, but they get dirty really easy. So yeah, I have this coffee table. It's from Urban Outfitters. I love this so much. And actually it was in the dressing room, just like had a bunch of candles and like miscellaneous stuff on it. I have this little, this little tray I got from a thrift store and on it I have just candles, um, matches, and then this little Christmas decor touch. Yeah. And then if you look over here, we have this big mirror and it's from Ikea. Also had a lot of questions about that. Really affordable mirror. And it's honestly like the perfect size for, um, <laughs> for outfit picks and all that. I love this mirror. And then I got this TV stand when we moved here from Crate and Barrel. And I just love the wicker um, little touches to it. All right, so moving into the master bedroom where all the magic happens. Okay, so when you first walk in, this is what you see. Our bed just takes up the entire room, but I feel like it's just how it's supposed to be in a bedroom. Just a fat, big bed with tons of pillows where you can't even see the bed anymore. Like, it's kind of ridiculous. So I like this um, bed frame a lot, actually, because it has a little bookcase built into it, which I thought was really cool. What was really important for me was getting a new bed frame was Jasper because he was having a hard time jumping onto the bed. And I was like, I felt really bad. And so I thought a platform would make it a lot easier and it has. It takes him one try now instead of five to get out of bed. Um, but yeah, so all the art and the lamps are from Target. And um, so is the bedding, honestly, all of it's from Target as well. Over here we have a space where we're gonna get a dresser, but for right now is just a couple boxes with <laughs> an attempt to hide them. This is like this throw just on them. And then here is the master bathroom. Nothing, whoa, nothing too special. It is a really good sized bathroom. I filmed a closet tour uh, two weeks ago, so if you're interested in seeing my closet and all the details, I'll link that below and make our way out. I don't know where Brendan went. I think he like disappeared to check on the dogs. Um, but when you first walk in, we have this day bed. I love this day bed. It's from Urban Outfitters. Honestly, like everything is. The rug is from Urban Outfitters, Ottoman. The day bed, that uh, art piece right there. This mirror is all from Urban Outfitters. 
and I am obsessed. And then clothes rack, which I have kind of newer items. And then that's from Ikea, super cheap. And then on top of the dresser, we have a lamp and it's a picture of me and my mom. And then I absolutely love this rose box. This is like over a year old. It's from Valentine's Day and it still looks amazing and it smells so good. And then last room is the guest bathroom. Um, it just looks like this, so a little vanity area. And I'm obsessed with this, this scent, Anthropology. This is the Capri Blue Volcano scent. And this is, I think, their most popular candle, or at least one of them. So I was like, I am buying this when I saw that they had hand soap and lotion. And then little, you know, toilet area, towels, and then our shower slash bathtub. And yeah, that is pretty much it for the apartment tour. I hope that you guys liked it. And be sure to comment with other videos you want to see me do. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Love you.